Getting a little too hot in the kitchen? Just give me my order before I lose my cool. All right, just punching the heck the the daylights. Hey, what is going on, everybody? It's me, Cedric here, and welcome to our first Let's Play of Bayonetta 3. As you guys have known, for those of you who have been long enough on my channel, I have played Bayonetta 2 on my channel before. If you want, I will leave it a link in the upper right-hand corner if you guys want to check that out. But I am so excited to play this on the channel. I played a little bit going on forward. It is amazing. I fell in love with Bayonetta. The first time I ever played it was on... Probably the first time it was on a Wii U, the cousin of mine had. But I, I just enjoyed the game so much. It was like Devil May Cry because I wasn't really, I couldn't really get into Devil May Cry when I was a kid because I didn't have the consoles. But it was like a nice substitute to go along the way. But I'm just gonna go ahead and just go ahead and press start here. Bayonetta. I'd always believed there was only one truth, but. What if some other version of me, on a distant world, was searching for all possibilities? And what if, when all the possibilities were overlaid, the path that stood out the clearest was the real truth? So yeah, they're starting us right in the middle of the action here. As you guys may have recognized before, that was a entry sequence in the Game Awards in 2017 that they previewed five years ago. That was I wasn't really interested in that game, and I'm surprised that they actually included that scene in this in the in the game after it looks so much different from how it initially started. But I'm still glad. And here we have Gamara attacking a homunculi, one of the new enemies in the game we'll be facing. Again, I have not gone too far into the game, just a, a few couple of the chapters, like maybe two or three of them. So I may know what's coming out from here on out. But that won't stop me from playing the game on my free, on my free time. But here we go. This is an unknown enemy, I have no idea who it is, but we just got kicked their ass as best as possible. But knowing this is just the prologue, I doubt we're going to be able to do any serious damage. Alright, so we just got to try and attack. Alright, so we're not going to be doing much damage here. Somewhere, some version of me was walking along through the grass just like me. All right, so we just gotta try and kick as much ass as possible. The same path, taking the same journey. And I'm just gonna try and kick this the hell out of this jackass. Any anime or sci-fi And even after growing up, Gamora just still right right now. They're duking it out. I just knew that someday a version of my father from some other world would appear. And pull out and attacking. Just, for me, always used to. just trying to knock this guy out as much as possible here. So we just need to. Okay, see? There it is. But it come to crush all hope like blades of grass beneath his heel. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Whew. I'm just gonna try and give him as best as I can here. Oh, he just pushes us back as as, as, try, as even though we try to get close enough. Oh. Look out! 
He broke witch time. And he cracked our, our amulet. Oh no. I'm not done yet. What's wrong? Having trouble running. We can't shoot anymore. So we're trying to hurt this guy as much as possible, but we can't do anything, we're in a crippled state. He's just dusting us off! I, I saw that little motion that he just dusted us off there. Ah! You gotta understand, Bayonetta's no pussy. This ain't looking too good for us. Soldier. This is our last world bridge. Dang, man. But yep, that is how it is for the Bayonetta of that universe. So, again, for those of you who not have any experience with Bayonetta whatsoever, I'm not able to go into a long, detailed ex explanation of how it is. But in this game, it we are doing with alternate versions of the dimension we are in, meaning different Bayonettas, different 
allies who may seem familiar in other words, but they are not. So as you see, the bayonet of that world died, and now the bayonet of this world will be taking over her mission. So we're going to go ahead with a chaotic adventure. Let's start. As you guys already know, that was the prologue, as I explained before. So now let's see what the bayonet of this world is capable of. So, what was the weather forecast for today? What's the matter, your glass is dirty? Not a cloud in the sky. Perfect day for a ball game. And you know what that means, right? It means you found a way to drag me all over the city and turn my opening day ticket into toilet paper! Don't act like you don't hear me talking, huh? Huh? You know how much shit I had to go through for this thing? Oh! Ah! <sighs> oh! Shit! Jesus! How about a heads up for... Ah! You have my deepest sympathies. But don't forget, it was you who agreed to do anything I asked in exchange for that job. Just because I said anything now, doesn't mean... let's deal. Now, where do you want to go? I've been driving around this city since the crack of dawn. And now this damn thing's throwing a temper tantrum. What the hell are you doing? I just got this baby yesterday and... Less hot air, more gas. Everybody's getting screwed today. Me playing chauffeur, cause you gotta meet someone. So where are they? First the park, then the grocery store, and now you're saying you wanna try the pier. Hey, you even know where this mystery guest of yours is? What the holy shit! What the hell you do that for? Tell me you got the date wrong and stuff. No, it's today. And it's here. What? Enzo, what the you hell? wait right here. Oh. Got it? Right here. Don't move oh, one hey. inch. Uh, Jeez. 
All right. Hey, hey, hey. How long do you expect me to sit here for, huh? And what am I supposed to do? I know it's the same shit with her every time, but she still gets me by the short and curlies. <sighs> huh? Rain? Where'd all these clouds come from? The hell is that? Not again! Light from on high just means more holy bullshit! What the... <laughs> Uh, a girl? Who the... Where the hell did she come from? You know, this kid looks kind of familiar. Whoa! Hey! Please, take me to... Her. Do I look like a damn taxi driver? You mean... Oh, oh, her, oh. Theo! Whoa! Oh, yeah, this? Oh, this isn't just what I needed. You got the wrong idea. She just fell out of the damn sky. I got nothing to do with this kid. I swear. I just... Denzo, can't have you dying before I get my dough. Newer town, huh? And here's a friendly hello. You haven't forgotten my order. It's in the truck. Ready to go.
Yep, wouldn't we Bayonetta without doing something sexual? Nah, let's see. And, yep. So we're just starting off with regular guns here, folks. Which time on time. And down you go. And just kicking their asses. Gotta be careful with these guys. Whoop, I got hit. You guys will pay for that. So yeah, pretty much Bayonetta. Badass as usual. Just kicking ass. And she is one drop down hard witch. But to be honest, her outfit this time was kind of lacking. But I'm not complaining. She is still stylish no matter what she does, whether it's it's a bath towel or basically just or basically just walking with a bathrobe. And here we have the part where guns break.
just hope you can keep up. Seems like these guys are built different than usual. More new faces, I see. Then perhaps a bit of fancy dress yes, is in order. order. And here we go, folks. The new mode here we got. Demon Masquerade. Where we can incorporate the demons in our weapons into our fighting style. Oh, he got us. Nice try. Got him. Whoa. Down you go. Nice try. Okay, I gotta focus here. But this is pretty much fun. Whoa. Let's see. Cloud er Yeah, cloud erosion. So you gotta be careful with the clouds here because they will make you get insta-kill ya. Nice try. Oh, I forgot this thing likes to swing twice. Okay. And down you go. Ooh, look out. First first, done. Gold, not bad. Isn't everything you know. Here we go. Oh, yep, you gotta be careful with this guy. Punching the heck the the daylights. Down you go, climax. Now we'll just wait for him to nod a life out of ya. Sanctified seasoning. 
meets no deep. Better think fast, Bayonetta. Uh, storms are not worse than I thought. I thought was lost for good. Yep, so here we have it, everybody. The Demon Slave. A new mode incorporated into the game where now we can freely summon our demons anytime we want, but for a limited time only. So basically, you can just call your enemies, they'll attack, or help you out in a situation, but it also leaves you vulnerable for just a little bit of time. Alright, so that does it for a little training, so let's get back into the fray. I really like this mode, like you can mix and choose any kind of combination, but it depends on the weapons you're using. Nice try. And... Oh. Uh oh, here we go. Alright, I'm just fighting those attacking me for that second here. Oh, I didn't dodge it in time. What the heck? He's almost dead. Now it's game over for you, buddy. Not mashing Y, and yep, it's torn apart. Homunculi defeated. Another gold.
Jean. We'll catch up later. Well, you guys know Jean, when Jean's here, it's a party. Already been a man to turn the, the cruise ship into a battle cruise, but now... Well, I'm talking about battle cruise, now I'm talking about a battleship here. But now Jean's joining the fray, and I'm so happy that she's here. I just got beat up this demon. Take that. And some of this, too. Ugh, I just gotta focus on this thing here. This Kraken. I don't know what the heck it came from. It looks like the Kraken. And... Punch. And death. Time to kick some butt. And mashing buttons. Mm, that's gotta hurt. The hell? Uh oh. I knew it. It was the Kraken. No, Jean! I know we didn't just go for all that trouble to get you back in the second game for you to die here. That's right, sir. I need to see some ID. Who invited you on our cruise anyway? Gamora! Destroy this thing! Unleash it! Oof. Oof, oof. Ain't gonna happen. Missed me. Gamora. Oh, God. Damn that thing. Where'd it go? Whoa. Missed me. Suck lead. Where'd he go? Oh, here we go. Whoa, he still got me. I dodged way too early. Oh. Eat it. Do it. Do it. All right, gotta be careful with these tentacles here. Ah, come on! I wasn't even in the way. All right, Gamora, unleash it. All right, down he goes. Now one of my better challenges. Hopefully that did it. But I doubt it. Nope. I didn't finish him. Where is he? Whoa, that was close. It's not so hard when you know where he's coming from. Holy shit. Well, we can kiss that cruise ship goodbye. Or what was left of it. And now we're free falling. I'm going for a swim. Only being that I can survive a, su a tsunami. Now 
and here she is, the mistress of atrocity, Madama Butterfly. Bayonetta's signature demon. Now time to make sushi out of this thing. Cop of John. Got press A, press, 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 and there we go. So not just homunculi are gonna have to be battling here. It will also be demons sometimes. I believe it will be angels, but who knows? She's fine. Hard to believe she's intact. These Umber witches are way tougher than they are. But well, a lot of unanswered questions goes, who summoned these demons? Look out! Get out of the water! Whoa! Right in the kisser. Rodan! Samaritan Rodan. How dreadfully noble. We gotta talk. Preferably someplace a little quieter. You know? You kinda make me wonder why Rodan chose to get involved with us in the first place. Cause he's usually the guy who always says, Your fights are yours alone. <laughs> I don't know. He he sometimes have his off. I guess he's grown to like us over the franchise, but who knows? I sometimes have my suspicions about Rodan. But anyway, we've completed our first actual fight, and so far I've gotten gold for everything. No platinum, just straight gold. All right, so. I believe that'll do it for this episode, guys. That was one action-packed start for a fantastic game so far, what I'm starting to let you know. I played a few of the chapters already. It is great. I highly recommend you guys buy this game. If you are into action patches, button mashing, fun, and the story is so far pretty good. So, thank you guys so much for tuning in. And if you did enjoy the video, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and ring my bell so you don't miss anything else. And I'll see you guys on the next one. So, have a good day, everybody.